So I am making some vanilla extract to give as Christmas gifts this year. And I just wanted to show you what the process looks like. So this jar over here has been sitting for a while. And as you can see, it's pretty dark and looks pretty much like vanilla extract. This jar right here, I just started. And so as you see, it's got, uh, it's pretty clear liquid so far with just the vanilla beans sitting in there. I use vodka for mine, and in particular, that's what I used. But it really doesn't matter um, what kind of vodka you use uh, because vodka is pretty neutral. You could use rum if you wanted to, um, other alcohols like that, but you will enhance the flavor or change the flavor from what it would naturally be. I just use vodka because it will yield the most true vanilla flavor. So all you do is you get a glass jar, make sure that it is glass, and you get some vanilla beans. These I actually purchased online from Amazon, but you can get them anywhere. Just make sure that they are whole vanilla beans. And then what you do is you just slit each one open and put it in the jar. How much you put in the jar really depends on taste. I've seen everywhere from three to eight beans per cup of alcohol. So um, quite a wide range there. So just use whatever you feel. I mean, if you have a lot of vanilla beans, why not? Go ahead, put that much in. Um, one bottle of vodka, and like the bottle I just had out, is that much liquid. So figure one bottle of alcohol per mason jar. It's about three cups, a little over three cups. So what you do is you uh, put your vanilla beans in, put the, the vodka on, make sure you've slit your vanilla beans. It doesn't have to be perfect. If your jar is shorter than mine or your beans are longer, go ahead and cut them in half. It's okay. And then you put the lid on tightly, give it a good shake, and then you put it in a dark cabinet and give it a shake about once a week. It will be ready for consumption in about a month, but it, it never goes bad. Um, it, like vanilla extract, it's, it's got about the same shelf life, which is forever. And the other nice thing about vanilla extract is that it makes more. So like uh, when I transfer this into smaller bottles for people, I'll have on the little tag that if you want to keep going with this vanilla extract as you use some, just pour in some more vodka and keep giving it a shake and it'll just make more. Um, and this can go on not indefinitely, but for quite a while. So that's kind of like the gift that keeps giving. Um, and also on the tags, you might want to point out that there's going to be little black specks and that is actually desired. That's the, the vanilla beans and it's, uh, it's just all flavor and it's really good. So that's what it looks like in process, uh, finished and in process. So when you go ahead and do it, you'll know what to expect.